Compare and Select is the Embryo Viewer software tool for comparing embryos across treatments from one patient. In this video, we will look into the different features of the Compare and Select tool. When the embryos have been annotated, go to the Compare and Select page to compare and evaluate all embryos. First, I would like to introduce to the page and after that go into the functionalities. The drop-down menu under Current Model presents a list of models available. These are designed or imported under Settings. This example is a Day 5 culture and therefore we will apply the KidScore Day 5 model to assist the decision during the embryo evaluation process. The KidScore model will calculate a score for each embryo to rank them according to the statistical chance of implantation. The calculations are based on the annotation you have done for each embryo. Here you'll get an overview and status of all your annotated embryos. Note that well number AA2 appears with a red triangle in the column not 2 pm. The others have a green dot. This means that the embryos were annotated with a number that was not 2. The following annotations show a question mark because no annotations were performed for uh, these parameters yet. This could be due to an active choice, for example, if the embryo did not develop to a transferable stage. To check, you can open the window last image. This function shows the latest image acquired for the embryo. The four embryos with the highest score will be displayed at the bottom of the page. If you want to view other embryos, simply select them in the column called Well. The selected embryos appear light blue in this column. In case you would like to review the whole embryo development, you can double click on the selected embryo row to open the annotate page. Embryos that you consider not transferable can be marked with the red decision icon for avoidance. This could, for example, be the not 2 pm embryos. There are two extra columns with information that could be interesting for your evaluation process, last stage and morph grade. Last stage is the last morphokinetic stage you have annotated for this embryo. MorphGrade is intended to be used as a customized morphology evaluation. Some clinics assess this variable on the last picture of the embryo. To make a final decision of which embryo to transfer or freeze, compare the transferable embryos with other relevant information. The software provides you with different options to do so. In this example, we applied the KidScore Day 5 model. If we click Save, the current score will appear in the column Saved Score. Apply an information model defined under Setting with relevant information. Now you get an overview of all embryos with selected information and on the right hand side also the KIT score ranking for comparing all parameters. Another option is to compare up to six embryos in side by side view. Annotated comments will be displayed in these boxes, and information about four parameters of your choice will be displayed here. Contact VitroLife support for help in setting up these parameters. Use the decision icons for transfer and freezing of the embers based on your evaluation and decision. Return to model view. Finally, save the transferred embryo with a transfer date and confirm. That way you can register outcome per transfer later on. Before leaving the page, make sure that all embryos are marked with a decision icon. Note that information related to transferred or avoided embryos now appear in pale gray text. Only frozen embryos appear in bold as they are still available for transfer. You can also use Compare and Select function when evaluating which embryo to prioritize as first choice for warming and thawing for later transfer in a frozen cycle. To see if other frozen embryos are available, 
select view all patient embryos. Now all embryos appear across treatments. To get a better overview of all embryos, you can use the sort function in the decision column and select only frozen embryos. To ensure traceability, once the decision for transfer has been made, use the pink decision icon for frozen transferred embryos and save the embryo with a date. As you have seen, the Compare and Select tool can support your efficient embryo evaluation because you as a user can compare embryos across treatments and all embryos for one patient with a set of parameters and a defined ranking. Take a look at our other videos in Information Model in Compare and Select for further details on how to set up the system for evaluation. Thank you.